That's a nice positive off drive to get on underway. It'll go all the way. Well timed. Good confident shot. Well, whether it's uh, 5.30 or midday, when Jayasriya gets a short ball outside the off stump and he feels... Oh, lovely shot. This has been a very positive start by the Sri Lankan openers. Goes all the way. Long chase around here for Kuravilla, but he won't get there. So another boundary for... In a test match for the first time. And what a beautiful shot, gracefully played, beating the mid-off, standing up, perfectly timed. Atapatu, everything in place. Well, this is the problem Kumble has had. He, after three or four good tight deliveries, he does drift on to leg stump and promptly punished there by... And some more runs here. That's a lovely shot. This will be another boundary. And he's got him, I think, with his very first ball in Test cricket. He struck. Very well timed. Ball sped to the boundary. He really didn't look to put any power in that at all. It was all timing. So that raises the 50. That's the second time he's got the under edge. He gets four runs for it this time, but was lucky he didn't drag it back into his stumps. On the first occasion, the ball... <laughs> well, this time he doesn't get in the way, and Jayasuriya puts a full toss away for four. But he will feel very, very nervous. In and that's a great shot. Just a little bit short. Jayasuriya, plenty of room to get back. Slow week. And he's gone again. The result the same. Yes, yeah, not very good bowling from Chan. Going round the wicket and just giving. And it uh, goes just fractionally short, and Jayasuriya pounces on it. Another boundary to bring up his 50. Very, very good knock so far from. Too much down the leg side. That's one of the things that Ravi Shastri talked about last evening that uh, Kumble has a tendency to stray down the leg. It's a better shot. Had the. Uh bit of movement that brings up the hundred for Sri Lanka and a very positive style this is this time he gets the ball away works around that front pad this time won't quite go to the boundary to do chasing slides and just pulls it back in it should run four though it's good running from the full pitch too much on leg stump so he's finally Waited, and that's what the batsman has got to do. He's got to wait for the bowler to make a mistake and pick it off, and that's what Mahanam has done there. The stick. Well, that's a lovely shot through the offside. He's again found the gap. Another boundary for Jayasuriya. Once again, a flashing cover drive by Jayasuriya. This is a very fine shot. He's picked it on length. He swept it from outside the offstop. Smashed it. Opportunities outside the offstop. And there we go. Again, it's happened most of the morning. The Indian spinners have erred. It's been on the short side, and the wicket is slight. Just a little bit of bat. Short. That's too short. There's some good batting by Mahanama there. Sold him the double bluff. Kennedy was going to run. That shot is his strength to Jasaria. Waiting for it and getting it fine. Right between the two fielders. Absolutely bisecting them. And he beats Corvella. That'll carry him to 99. Three fours in the open. After Harry. But he gets it. And he'll pick up the extra run as well. So Suna, Jaya Surya, moving. That is a cheeky shot. A very cheeky shot indeed, just a little dab down towards third man. Beautiful to be stuck by Mahanama that time. Kulkani looking to give that ball a little bit of air, trying to draw Mahanama forward. But Mahanama very... Oh. 
The shot he's played very well all day, and again. Oh, that's another lovely shot. Delicate, played it late. That's a shot that Mahanamo plays extremely well. We've seen him use it more than once in this innings, and that was an exquisite with Chauhan, the off spinner. Nice juicy full pass. Now yeah, Syria's not going to miss the opportunity then. And he's got it through. Jair yeah, Syria after being watchful. And that's a single that'll bring up 150. It's been a fabulous innings by this explosive left hand. Bit of googly on that, but it didn't matter. Ball very short indeed. And he's got it away. So that's Roshan Mahanamo's fourth test hundred, and he's done it in style. He joins son of Jason. Years prior to this, but, uh, he's right back in form now. Short again and four again. And there's absolutely no value in pitching short and. Getting loose once he's reached his hundred, he's playing a lot more positively. He's been there long enough. Magnificent cover drive. Well, he's played a number of. And Mahanama now joins the fun. Anything you can do, I can do. Well, if not, better. There's no third man. And that'll go for another four, so that raises the... And that'll go away again. That cut shot is very productive for Jaya Surya, as it is. Well, he's got it. Doesn't have to worry about getting a single there. Whipped away. Mahanama's turn now to get into the act. He's found the gap through on the offside. And uh, we'll have to wait and see if he got any bat on it. Wide signal by the umpire. Oh, that's a lovely shot. It's got everything covered on top of it. And again, finding the gap on the onside. That's a nice shot on the onside. A long chase here for Sidhu. But again, the ball wins. That's a good shot. Really effortless, genuine half volley, just hit straight through the line, and that again he's given a bit of room and uh, looks a very different player when he's allowed some room. He doesn't, he's not. Oh. The 400 comes up for these two, their partnership over 300. How do you make sure that he goes into lunch, batting on 150? We can get it through the gap. Rather an ambitious shot and uh, a suggestion, and that's his uh, highest in the air again. But this time wide of the field from the Bradle boundary. And I think Kimbley will be uh, encouraged by that. The fact that he got the ball hit back in the air towards the end of last. Slower ball in the air. Finally, a false shot. Haven't been very many of them, but I think at last the bowlers are starting to. It'll cause some difficulty. Again, uh, this time it's a thick out, uh, outside edge. It'll go to the boundary, and that'll bring up the 400-run partnership between the. There it is. 250. The crowd right through the keeper. That'll go for four buys. 
Umpire France is just uh, checking to see as it rolls across the ropes and makes the signal. So four more to the score. Runs here. We'll have to wait for the umpire signal. Chase for Gug. So that raises the 500 for Sri Lanka. And that'll be the record. Goes away for four. No pick. That's a rare boundary for Jayasri. He hasn't hit many since lunch, but he's got hold of that one. And well, that's nicely played. He gave himself the room. Good footwork. This will take him to 197. This should be it. A chase here for Sidhu. And even though he pulls the ball back, Mahanama has time to come back for his 200th run. So again, a uh, the few occasions where he's gone over the top. It's four runs. To deep mid wicket there. And he reaches his triple hundred in glorious fashion. Smashing Pulkani over mid on. One bounce across. And he goes in the air this time. He's timed it beautifully. It's his second six. Sanchan just he was so good, it was hit against the spin. And this time he plays a lovely shot to mid wicket. Again in total control, again a chase for the Indian fielders, and again the ball wins. And he adds to his runs here, that'll go all the way for four. So Sanat Jayasuriya. Nilesh Kulkarni now to start the bowling. And the full pass first up. And that'll be another one. This is just what the crowd has come to see. They might have... They're up to third, and that's going to be another four for Jaya Saria. They're doing it in style. Ah! He's out. He's given him. Umpire Katie Francis has ended the partnership and brought a hush. Has come on. Ah! He's gone. Jaya Saria caught at silly point. So the record will elude the left-hander, and he walks off. Well, if they can get some of that in the next uh, couple of hours from Aravinda da Silva, batsmen, stars of the moment, have both gone early this morning, and there's Arjun around coming on the wicket to crash it away for four. It's Asia Cup. And there should be four more runs. He plays the shot very well, the sweep. He controls it nicely. Again, very well put away by Rana Tunga. He's very strong with that shot. Put footwork and placement. And hitting across the line here, and this time successful. So the 650 coming up with that boundary. 652 for three. And cut away by Rana Tunga. This is four runs. He plays the shot. Very, very well. And when he does that, he's taken on the full by Ranadunga and dispatched to the onside for another boundary. So consecutive boundaries here for the Sri Lankan captain. In this over, very poor over. He's bowled a short one outside the off stump to Ranatunga. That went for four, then a full toss. And now. Well, that's a lovely shot pass point. That's up and under from Renatunga. He's not mucking around and uh, every indication that maybe he's th That's a very, very good shot. You don't have to be offline very much on this wicket at the best of times, but it down. This time the faster flipper 
outside off stump and he shows his all-round versatility he lays back and crashes it past backward point in the air again we go for four down to the fine leg that brings up the 700 this is nicely played on the onside it'll beat Kuruwila to the fence he got it fine enough well, that's a lovely shot to bring up his 50 as good as any you've seen in this game beautifully played through mid wicket so 50 uh, and a glorious shot to bring up his 50 that was just dismissed from his presence by Arjuna Ranatunga well he's on a roll here he's not timed this one well but he'll again get a boundary there is no third man so Ranatunga here looking to entertain this to become the first Sri Lankan to score 4,000 runs in uh, test match cricket and this time he's done it and with good effect boundary number four so Kuruvilla here losing his school playing a miss I think that's uh, buys I don't believe there's any bat on that certainly no glove on it from the bigger keeper it's buys and I don't think we've seen the last of it today and this time he's got it through that outfield's very fast And that'll be four. He's very, very keen to work the ball away on the leg side, either with the sweep shot or... And the runs continue. Gone straight through him. Venkatesh Prasad, big man, not being able to get down in time, and it goes for four. He's a long way down. Umpire will ask for the help of the, the third up. That's nice to struck by Jawadana. Unprotected area on the offside. Jawadana quickly bouncing on that shot. 800 for the loss of four wickets. Once again, Jawadana giving himself room, waiting for that short delivery. Up is she played, ball running down to third man for four. Oh, juicy full toss on the onside, and Mahalaj Jawadana just picking the gap. There's no stopping him there. Again, good footwork there, right back on the stumps, so that he could find a gap on the offside. So another boundary for the... Yeah. And another lovely shot through the onside. It's not an easy shot to play, but Kumble doesn't spin the... But he's now got enough confidence that he can go down the wicket and plant this one through square leg for four. You really put that one away, Aravinda. Carries him four closer to that hundred. It's gone down towards the boundary. Now Aravind has looked at the umpire. He gives buys. So difficult time for talking to the former England captain uh, Tony Gregg. Courtesy of Lanka Bell. And uh, Greg, we have a, a friend of yours, colleague and playing colleague of yours, uh, Barry Richards with us. Oh, great. So he's been there watching. They obviously, as you have said before, there have been many, many occasions where they played well in one day cricket, and they have something to prove in Test Match cricket. And as we speak, Jawadina, the young fellow who's just come into the Test Match. 875 for four. And Araba de Silva moving on to 104 with yet, yet another boundary. And uh... he takes the aerial route and times it well. So the young man is growing in confidence here. Once he reaches 50, he's uh, sort of blooming out now. We've seen another fine shot from De Silva, who's swept Nilesh Kulkarni from middle of batsman uh, going for this world record. That's it. 900 runs on the board with that single. And that's not. And he cuts it away. Four runs to De Silva. 
Okay, this is the highest score by any team in international cricket in a single innings in a test match. Sri Lanka going. Oh, he's decided to cut loose here. That's another boundary for De Silva. Edged and it's gone between the keeper and the slip. If Mogia was there, that might well have been taken. But Rahul Dravid is a part-time keeper. He had no answer to that one. Taken. But Rahul Dravid is a part-time keeper. He had no answer to that one. It's 9.15 for four. Ten outside the leg stump. And this will be runs for him here. Another boundary. But we'll have to wait for the Empire signal and see if the Silva got any bat on it. Yes, a boundary signal. It's a brilliant catch. Absolutely brilliant catch taken there by Kulkani who flung himself at that drive on the up by Mahal. It's going to be caught on the boundary. Straight down his throat. So uh, Aravinda De Silva finishes with a blaze. Try Again he tries a late cut. This time he gets it past Kuravilla who's noticeably limping and struggling in the field with a test match coming up next Saturday and they take another run too rather untidy this one will go for four no fieldsman can get around and stop that he's finally got the sweep shot away to complete the over Sri Lanka 9 four. So that's the end of the over nine fifths on the last day the game can be called off so after 20 minutes of play and the 10 minutes for change of innings, that will be it for the Test match. Arjuna Ranatunga, the Sri Lankan captain there, alongside him, Mahanama. The players shake hands. They're probably all quite relieved that the game is over. Kumble there has been...